Hello, guys. Welcome back to Maison. African motives are still on engineering science and one uh, working on particle structure of matter. We are given the question uh, from February 2022 exams that you are going to focus with. Uh, so we have got uh, 9.1 where we are given uh, the question, give one property of each of the following phases. So we are given to describe like the properties that we have if we are in a gas state, all right? So what we have actually in a gas state, remember a gas state, the particles, they are free to just move. They are moving freely, okay? So at the end, we can state here that uh, we can say there is no definite shape, okay? So here we can have no definite shape, no definite shape. So if there is no definite shape, that means we do not have a definite uh, volume in this case, all right? Uh, then if you are to take a container, like you've got a container or a vessel, you fill in, this is just going to take the shape of the, of the container, it fills in, okay? So it fills the vessel as it is inside, okay? So this one, it also fills uh, the vessel, fills the vessel, all right? It is in, all right? So the vessel that it is in, it is going to fill up, okay? Another point is that it is compressible, all right? So gas is compressible. All right, so that's what we had. Uh, so if you've got any other point, please mention on the comment section so that uh, others can uh, take that as an advantage to learn from your from your definite or from your properties that you have there. All right, the solid state that is where we are now giving that uh, it, it, it's, it's in terms of the move. There is no movement. Uh, it, it, the particles they can only they can vibrate. Okay, so which is the same thing or, or that. We could have uh, mentioned also on the issue of movement that they are, the particles, they are free to move on the gas there. We, we can also add that as a point, okay? So in this case, then here we are now having a definite size, all right? So let's start with the size here or the shape. We are going to have a definite shape or definite size, all right? Then uh, in terms of, um, all right, the volume, okay, we can have it, okay, here as a definite size again or shape. Then we, in terms of being, we can we compress a gas we, or a solid? So this one is not. So it's uncompressible or in, is it incompressible or just right not compressible? I think we can just uh, save our grammar, okay? So the issue of grammar, guys, you know, uh, so you can just add any other points. Let us know, guys. Uh, it can help others. 9.2, what effect will, uh, will an increase in heat have on the particles in substances in each of the following? Okay, so when, when heat is being increased, what is the effect that it is going to cause if, the, if the, we have got particles in a liquid state? So definitely, if you add heat, we are going to change from liquid to, to gas. All right, so then... Particles will move more and the liquid will change to, to gas, okay? Uh, on 9.2, a solid, if you apply more heat to a solid, it is going to change to, to a liquid, okay? So particles will move more and the solid is going to change into a liquid. All right, so take note, guys. Uh, 9.3, name three subparticles of an atom okay what are these subparticles of an atom or what comprises of an atom okay an atom comprises of protons we've got protons electrons the neutron okay so we can just have the proton electrons all right we've got uh, electrons and also we've got the neutrons in this case all right so this is what actually comprises of an atom. Then on uh, 9.4, draw a neat labeled sketch of an atom. All right, so in this case, I'm going to show you a sketch of an atom that we are going to work with. All right, so if you are dealing with an atom, this is what you're going to have. Remember, we mentioned about uh, this before. So we have got, uh, in this case, so take note, uh, this diagram I mentioned uh, from, I, 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 I did this one from another, uh, question paper. So 
it's not like the diagram must be the same. You can take any diagram is the same, okay? So these are from the outer shell, we've got our electrons, all right? Then if we get to the nucleus here inside, we've got the proton and the neutron. So remembering that the neutron, we've got no charge, the proton are positive, electron negative, okay? So the nucleus is the one that consists of the proton and neutron. So that's uh, what the person actually wanted us to do. All right, so let's check back to the question. Uh, so that's what we had on question 9.4. It was to draw a neat labeled sketch of an atom. That's four marks. All right, so that's a total of 11 marks from this question. Uh, so that's what we had, guys, for Maison African Motives. Till we meet again.